Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we are gonna do quite a bit of things. Actually, we have a full day and I thought it would be fun to bring you guys along because we're also gonna go to a new thrifting spot today um, that I've never been and my parents have never been and they're gonna come with. And then we're gonna also head over to Rochester to pick up a piece of furniture and then drop off a mower at my brother's house in St. Charles. And then we're gonna head all the way over to Kenyon after that. So yeah, we got a lot of driving and a lot of stuff to do today. So I thought it'd be fun for you guys to come along. Hoi, can you say hi? Can you say hi? Hi, Cohen. <laughs> Hi, Cohen. Nana, stay home. Oh, are you tired, Cohen? Just a bunch of quick running around. Say hi. Hi. Way to go. Say my name's Eleanor. My name's Adela. Good job. Here's Cohen. Hi, Cohen. <laughs> Cohen's right here. Hi, Cohen. What do you want to say to everyone in Portugal? Everyone's Portugal. What do you want to say to them? Um. 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 Did you have a good day? Yeah. Did you have a good day? What do you want to say to everyone in the United States of America? States of America. <laughs> do you want to say have have a great day too? Is that your cocoa melon blanket? Yeah, it's a cocoa melon blanket. Cool. Can you tell us what your favorite food is? Um, pizza. Oh, nice. What's your favorite color? Um, pink. What's your favorite <laughs> animal? Giraffe. A giraffe? Yeah. What's your favorite... Um, who's your best friend? Ivy's your best friend? Yeah. Who's your favorite brother? Um, Cohen. Yeah, <laughs> he's your only brother. Is he your best friend too? Yeah. Aww. So sweet. So sweet. So after I got some breakfast, and then we went and picked up a dresser for my furniture flipping business. And then we're going to head to the thrift stores next. So we made it to Kenyon, Minnesota, which is a very small little town that has a few thrift stores in it. But unfortunately, the first one that we're going to, which is called Sift, and it has a ton of furniture and good stuff, it seems to be closed for a specific amount of time. I think they open up again on February 29th. But we drove up to there drove up to it and saw that they had the close sign luckily there's another thrift store that was open so we decided to go just to that one instead
And then we went to one that's in Casson, Minnesota, which I tried to go to a few days ago um, that was closed, but this time it was open. So we decided to check out everything there. I didn't find anything at this thrift store. I did find something at the first one, and I'll show you that closer to the end of this video. So you are looking at a vintage tea can, which if you know um, the brand Twinnings, it's a 25th anniversary tin or metal tea can. And then I also picked up a calendar at the dollar store. <laughs> then we went back home and I made myself a little lunch and I got a lot of flack for this online and yes this is what i ate for lunch it's not a snack okay so like ali always does i forgot to film an outro but for the rest of the day i hung out with cohen and eleanor because they actually came over and stayed the night and i worked on a little bit of my freelance work as well as i worked out so it wasn't too crazy for the rest of the day, but I also wanted to mention, I've been working on some thrifting as obviously this video is about. Um, and I've been finding stuff that um, is kind of like more of the vintage vibe if you're trying to go for that vibe in your house for home decor. And if you're interested, you can look on my Instagram and I usually post either my stories or I actually make a post of all the items that I have that I'm selling. So if you want to, I'll put it up on the screen, my Instagram. Go ahead and go and follow there and you'll see all the stuff that I am selling. Okay, so I thought I'd just give you like a quick little sneak peek of things I'm selling and like kind of the vibe I'm going for. So I have like this wicker basket, hasn't sold yet. Um, also like just kind of odd things that you can use for different, like this could obviously be put in your pantry. This could be put outside and put flowers in it. Like there could be so many different things you use this for, but it has that like the old vintage camping feel. And I'll put some more pictures up on the screen of other things that I found and have sold or are still selling. Um, so you kind of can get the vibe of what I look for and what I sell. So that way, if you are a vintage girly or you're a vintage guy, go ahead and follow me.